So I have this basket and I really like it. And I thought it would be nice if I could sort of make a similar size basket out of the birch bark. So I'm actually kind of using it as a template. I put it on top of an old file folder, which I recycle, repurpose uh, into many different things. I just don't throw everything out. I trace the bottom of it and I'm going to try to make it into a little bit of a better oval shape. I basically folded the piece of folder into four quarters and just cut it out. And now I'm just opening it up to see if the shape is what I'm looking for and it looks pretty good to me. I'm actually pretty happy with that. So the size of this is approximately 11 inches wide by a little less than seven inches deep. It's about six and three quarter inches deep. And hopefully that'll make a nice little centerpiece. I have a little bit of an idea to make these as gifts uh, for some very special people. Now this part's going to be a little tricky. I'm going to try to lay the basket on its side and sort of get a tracing of the width and the length but I also kind of want to be able to have my birch bark basket like not go straight up and down. I want it to lean out on the edges a little bit as this basket does. Um, so I'm going to try to figure out that exact angle for the two ends and so that it works. So we'll see what happens. So that's a really kind of a rough tracing and I need to remember that on each end I need to have at least a half inch, a quarter inch to a half inch of hangover. Um, so that I can sew the two pieces together on the ends of the basket. But hopefully this will work out good. I'll just fold this folder in half to cut it out. So I did, I kind of traced it as simple as I can and it looks like it will work. Of course I have it on the inside right now rather than the outside so it should be a little bit higher and if you look at it, it is a little bit higher. If this pattern works out, I'll uh, make a um, I'll make a little printout for you that you can go to my website for uh, and download for free if you want to try this yourself. So that's what it looks like and I think it will work. Now I just need to go cut it out in the bark.